loading. What's going on, Facebook? What's going on, Instagram? You guys, I hope you're having the best Monday of your entire freaking life. We're going to wait for some people to get in here. I'm going to grab my water. Currently in a shit ton of discomfort with my body, but that is okay. Guys, today we're going to be talking about vibration. We're going to be talking about what kind of a, of a person are you? Are the person are you the person that decides to wake up in the morning and 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 have a, a positive and optimistic mindset, you know, and be high vibrational? Or are you going to be the person that you know, say something happens to you the night prior or the day prior, you had a shitty week, and then you know that you let that energy roll into your Monday, you let that energy roll into your weekend. You, you're either a high vibrational person or you're a low vibrational person. Stephen, what's going on, brother? Happy fucking Monday, bro. Good to see you in here, man. Today's gonna be a fire live, guys. Today I'm actually gonna have to keep it really short. So just to brief you guys on my upcoming week, I'm actually super excited. And Stephen, as you know, bro. I've been kind of taking a lot of trips recently. It's totally unlike me. Gabriel, what's going on, brother? We got that fresh cut, baby. And no, I don't have any product in it. We're just wearing a little eagle cap today, a little uh, flat bill here. But um, guys, I will be going to the Florida Keys this Saturday. We're leaving super early Saturday for a family vacation. My family vacation this time. A couple weeks ago was with my girlfriend's family vacation. So Back and forth, right? So I'll still be working from the keys. You guys are going to see a lot of really cool stuff down there. I'll try to keep you guys updated with what's going on. Unacceptable. Unacceptable, Chance. You are pathetic. You are pathetic. I have that product too, bro, that I bought from you. That's the, that's the thing. I have it. I just didn't put it in my hair. Anyways, as I was saying, guys, I'll be going to the keys Saturday. I will still be working. That's the beautiful part about working online, having an online job. I'll be bringing my selfie light with me, my computer, phone, all of my stuff. So I'll be working from down there. But if you guys, that's what I'm doing this coming up week. Just kind of wanted to let you guys know that. But if you guys are just tuning in, make sure you guys tag three people. Tag three people in the comments that needs to hear today's motivational mindset live stream slash podcast. This is going to be a fire podcast, guys. We're going to be talking about what kind of a vibrational person are you? I don't care what you guys believe in. If it's God, if it's the universe, if it's the power of manifestation, if it's energy, We are all made up of a certain vibration, right? Like we all have a consciousness. We all have this energy and this vibration flowing freely throughout our minds, bodies, and our spirits. And it is up to us on how we, on on who we decide to be, right? The vibration that we decide to play at, the vibration that we decide to bring into our week, the vibration that we decide to, to, put forth on other people, right? We get to make that decision for us. Nobody else gets to make that decision, right? We get to make that decision. Guys, I'm in pain. I'm in discomfort every day. I try not to talk about it. I talk about it all the time on here, but I am. But I make the decision that every single morning, even though I might be in a shitty mood, I might be in discomfort, that I I literally tell myself, you are going to have a great day. You are going to feel good. You are going to give it 100%. You are going to play at a high vibrational level. So that's what we're gonna be talking about today. Tag three people in the comments. We're going to get this shit rock and roll, guys. I'm going to keep this shit super, super short today. I'm going to spit some fire, spit some motivation at you guys, get you guys off your ass, get you guys inspired to go out and be the best Steven, the best Gabriel, the best whoever's listening to this. If you guys are listening to this on replay, make sure you guys hashtag replay in the comments so I know you guys tuned in and hopefully got some value from today's podcast, from today's training. If you guys have some water in front of you, make sure you guys are drinking water periodically throughout this training, throughout this live. I will remind you guys, Spicy James, James Ellington, what's going on, brother, man? Happy freaking Monday. You are in for a treat today, my friend. This is going to be an absolutely awesome podcast. I know, Gabriel, bro, you just showed me how to, and I'm going to make a post about that. If you guys, um, my barber, Gabriel, he just... uh, showed me the other day when he was cutting me on Saturday about turning on post notifications. If you guys do not want to miss this live stream, what I want you guys to do, and I'm going to upload a, like a a screen recording of this later today or this week on how you can click notifications. If you guys go to my profile at chance Galloway fitness, there's going to be a little bell icon right next to my name. You click that bell icon and then make sure you guys click all notifications. So turn on all notifications. That way, every time I go live, you guys get a notification that I'm going live. 
Most days, yes, it is at 12 o'clock Monday through Friday, but sometimes I'm running late. Sometimes I might have to run a little bit early. So I wanted to let you guys know ahead of time, if you do like these live streams, if you do like these podcasts, if you say you guys are listening to the audio version of this live stream on my podcast, make sure you guys go to Instagram, click the bell icon, and then click for notifications all or on or whatever the option is. And uh, that way you guys don't miss a, miss any future episodes. So Yes, Gabriel, my man, I see the clapping emojis. Thank you for that that little trick there, man. I'm always learning something new. I used to hate technology, guys. I was never a big fan of it until I started, you know, getting into online coaching more and more and more. And now it's what I do full time. So you kind of have to learn a little bit of technology, technology to be successful with an online coaching, fitness coaching business. So anyways, guys, I see um, Stephen, you, you put Brennan in the comments. I freaking love that. Tag some more people. Let's get this area popping. Let's get this Facebook, Instagram. Let's get it popping today, guys. I'm super excited for this week. Like I said, I have five days until I go down to the Florida Keys. Hopefully get some lobster, some mahi-mahi. Going to be doing a lot of diving. Um, I was practicing this weekend with my girlfriend, Kay Curry. I'm surprised she's actually not in here right now. But I was showing her how to breathe on, on air, on, on pressurized air in our pool. Um, so that was a really cool experience. So we're getting all ready, getting all excited. It's been three years since we've had a nice family vacation. So I am looking forward to that. I will still be working. Um, but yeah, guys, that's it. I'm going to get into today's training. We are going to go live here. Um, like I said, tag anyone else that needs to hear this training. Um, and then let me see here. I will send this to some people and then we will get started. Bam, bam. Hope you guys are having the best freaking day ever. If you're just tuning in on Facebook, we're going to send that and we're going to get started. Make sure you guys get a nice water chug here. I'm working on returning that Berkey. I found out that they weren't certified through the NSF. And then there's another water purification certification thing that like you need to have and they don't have it. So I'm working on returning that system and then getting a brand new system from a different company that actually has the proper certifications that I would like to have in a $450 water purification uh, system, right? Like if I'm going to be putting tap water, which is clearly toxic with heavy metals, uh, with different acidity levels, the pH is all off. There's so much contaminants, microplastics, shit in tap water we should not be drinking. So if I'm investing four to $500 in a nice, you know, water filtration system with black carbon filters and all this fancy wording that they use, I expect for them to have some decent, um, accreditations, right? Like certifications that are, that are nationwide. They don't have them. So I'm dealing with all of that. I say that because I was drinking out of plastic and obviously I'm not a fan of plastic. So guys, we're going to get this started in three, two, one. What's going on guys. Welcome back to another episode on the relentless life podcast. I'm your host coach chance, and I'm super stoked for today's episode 108 on the podcast guys. Today's live stream, today's podcast Today's replay, whatever you guys are listening on, is going to be about energy. It's going to be about living in a certain vibration. It's going to be about making the decision to wake up every single day, seven days a week, 365 days a year, and making the decision to say, I am going to be in a high vibrational state today. No matter what my circumstances, I'm going to fucking squish my excuses. I'm going to squish my mistakes. I'm going to squish my embarrassments. I'm going to squish what happened to me yesterday. I'm going to fucking stand up and I'm going to say I'm the one and I'm going to live at a high vibrational capacity, a high vibrational level. Guys, you have that potential to do that. I do that. I do that every single day and I'm no different than you guys. The only difference that might be between me and you is the mindset that I decide to choose for myself. Andrew dealership, what's going on boss, man? I hope you're having the best Monday of your entire life. If you're just tuning in on Facebook, thank you guys for tuning in. This is going to be a fire episode on the podcast. So guys, vibration, right? You hear about it all the time. You know, it can kind of come off as a, as a woo woo type of a practice, you know, Oh, he's high vibrational or Oh, she has, has low energy or, you know, all these things vibrate, trees vibrate, he vibrates, the couch vibrates. Like you hear this all the time, right? Like, what does that mean? I believe that when you speak about a vibration or you speak about, you know, vibrational energy, It's exactly that guys. It's the rate. It's the, the capacity at which our minds, our souls and our bodies all radiate at, right? It's the level of frequency that we give off. You know, this energy that I'm giving off to you guys right now is obviously high energy. It's highly vibrational. And that is 
that is what it takes guys to, to be truly happy, you know, to make that decision to say, I'm going to have the best day of my entire life. I'm going to stand up and I'm going to go to the gym instead of sitting on my couch and watching Netflix and eating ice cream for the next hour and a half. Like that is a high vibrational attitude. That is a high vibrational mindset. And you guys literally have that decision to make every 24 hour period. Fuck it. Every second of every day, you have the decision to, you know, let a negative situation, a negative circumstance determine the level of vibration that you're going to give out to not only other be- other people, but your surroundings and most importantly to yourself. Guys, hit some fire in the comments if this is hitting with you guys today. I, I heard a podcast the other day about high vibrational energy and I was like, oh my God, I am playing at such a low level, right? Like you guys see me all over social media. I'm always trying to hype up my clients. I'm always doing this and doing that. I'm fucking everywhere, right? But I realized like I'm still only playing at 50 or 60% of my full capabilities and my full capacity. And, and I heard this message and I was like, holy crap, like I'm not playing at my full potential. And it's because my energy and my vibrations are low as fuck. And I'm here to tell you guys that your vibrations and your energy are probably low as fuck. And until somebody comes into your life and steps into your life and says, Steven, dealership, Andrew, Gabriel, you're playing at a low fucking level, man. I get it. You're working 60, 70 hour weeks. But you're playing at a low vibrational level. You think you you think you're putting in like yes, you might be putting in the work, you might be sacrificing time, but there's always more you can do. There's always more that you can give. There's always a, a, a higher vibrational mindset that you can encompass, right? Like like think about it, guys. Like it's not about being perfect, but it's about improving. It's about taking a mind that was once weak. And training it with consistent action and consistent affirmations to telling it, look, you were once here and now you're here. What is our next step? What is the next phase in this progression? Where we, where do you want to go, right? What is the vibration that you want to carry into each and every day? Guys, I struggled with anxiety. I struggled with depression. I struggled with insecurities and I still do. And I still do. It might not look at it, guys. When I come on live here, when I come onto the podcast, you might not think that I struggle with those things. But, guys, I'm here to tell you that that's the reality that I live in. But I make the decision that those things, that anxiety, that depression, those insecurities are not going to dictate my vibration. I'm aware of those things. The first step is acknowledging, yes, I struggle with being an anxious person, right? I struggle with biting my nails. I struggle with overthinking things. I struggle with anxiety in public with thinking, how do I look right? Like that, that happens to me. And I know that happens to so many of you out there. If this, if this resonates with you guys, I want to see some fire in the comments. I want to see who can relate to that, who can relate to struggling with anxiety, to struggling with depression, to struggling with, with self-critical thoughts or overthinking. I know there's a ton of you guys out there that think the same way as me. I'm not alone, but guys, it is about the decision that you decide to make on how you're going to shift yourself, you're going to shift, right? Because we're in the state of, of anxiety. We're in the state of depression. We're in the state of, of insecurity and overthinking. You, you're aware of it. You acknowledge it. And now you say, okay, let's make a mental shift. Let's, let's trade off now. I'm anxious, but I want to get here. I want to, I want to play at more of a high vibrational level. I want more energy. I want to be more positive. I want to be more confident. And then what you do is you decide and say, I'm going to step into that confidence. I'm going to start doing things that allow me to play at a high vibrational level. And you guys have that decision to fucking make. Nobody else is going to make that decision for you. Like, are you going to be, are you going to be the guy at your 10, 15, 20 year class reunion? That is like, oh yeah, you know, I'm still, I'm still working the, the, the landscaping business or I'm still working for Joe Schmo. Or I'm still working at, at mullets aluminum or, or whatever you're doing that you were doing at 21 or 24 years old. And at your 10, 15, 20 year class reunion, you're still doing the same shit. Like, do you want to be that guy? Or do you want to be the guy that's like, I started my own company. I've been working my ass off for the last 10 years or, you know, and now I run a multi-million dollar company or, you know, I'm the guy that started at 150 pounds. Steven, I started at 167 pounds. Now I'm 196 pounds a year and a half later, bench pressing 320 pounds. I feel super good with my shirt off. I'm in a healthy relationship. I, you know, I no longer get insecure, like whatever it is for you, 
you have to make that decision today to say, I don't want to be the guy at my class reunion in 15 years from now that didn't change a goddamn thing about not only myself, but the way that I think and the way that I view and perceive myself in the world around me. Like, who, who are you going to be? Who, who do you want to be? Like, that's the question you need to ask. Who do you want to be? If you want to be the same motherfucker you were five years ago and, and be the same guy from then to now to in five years from now, that's fine. And if you're good with that, fucking that's fine. But if you don't want to be that, I'm here to wake you guys up and say that you need to do a little bit more than what you've been doing to get different results than what you've been getting. And it all comes down to the vibration we decide to play at consistently every 24 hour period. Guys, it comes down to energy. It comes down, you know, we talk about being relentless. We talk about overcoming obstacles. We talk about all of this shit. But if you don't have a vibration, a high vibrational energy and a high vibration and decide to make the decision to be and live in that vibration all of the time, you're not going to change. Your mind dictates all. Your mind dictates and perceives the surroundings and the environment that is around you. Like you guys got to get that through your fucking minds today, through this podcast and through this live stream. Guys, if I'm hitting it, hit some fire. If I'm hitting the message today, hit some fire. If I'm relating with you guys and you've been there and you've struggled with these things, with anxiety and depression and self-confidence, and you made that decision to say, Chance, I'm ready. I'm stepping into who I'm supposed to be. I'm stepping in to a higher platform, a higher power, a higher source of energy, a higher source of, of vibration. Hit some fire. I want to see that this is hitting with somebody today. Guys, I am not playing, man. I am not playing with you guys. I'm trying to wake somebody up. I'm trying to show you guys that if you can get on a new level, if you can play in a new field, in a new, in a new fucking, you got to, you got to separate yourself, guys. You got to separate yourself from who you used to be. You see, guys, you are always going to get the same result. You're always going to get the same girl or the same guy or this or the same level of respect from your friends. If you continue to play at the same fucking level, that's what you guys need to understand. But as soon as you can shift your mindset into believing that not only do you deserve it and that you're worth it, but as long as you play at a high vibrational level, anything is fucking possible. You guys need to know this. And I want you all to know this. I want you all to get this from today's podcast, from the live. And by the way, guys, if you're just tuning in, if you're just tuning in, you need to go back and rewatch this podcast, rewatch this live, rewatch this podcast, hashtag replay, hashtag I'm here. Guys, I am not playing with you today. Vibration is everything. Vibration is who we are to the core. It's who we are to the core. I mean, guys, I can walk into a room. Watch this. I'm going to blow your fucking minds. I could walk into a room wearing the same thing at the same time of day with the same exact people in the room in the same environment, right? Variables are all the same. The only difference, the only difference is my vibration, is the level of energy I decide to play at, right? I walk into a room. My mood is down. I'm just... Walking in. Hey. Hey, how's it going? Yeah. How you doing? Um, uh, I'm good. I'm good. Hey. You know, maybe like picking up my hands or something, right? You go from that to Hey, what's going on, guys? How's it going? Yeah, man. It's good to see you, bro. Oh man, I'm freaking crushing it, bro. Like I started this online coaching business and dude, I'm loving it, bro. I just crushed the gym yesterday. I hit a 315 squat and yeah, man, I got a new girlfriend. Like, she's awesome. She's always there for me. She loves me, like, unconditionally. I'm just super fucking happy. How you doing, bro? Tell me about you. Like, you guys see the difference in energy there? Like, walking into a room, just kind of, like, moping. Like, yeah, man, hey, how's it going? Like, all, like, timid. Or you just walk in and you say, hey, how's it going, guys? You know, good to see you. Same exact scenario, same environment, same people, same situation, same time of the day. I don't give a fuck. Name it all the same variables, but the only difference is the level of vibration and energy I decide to play at, right? And you see the difference, right? Like if I walked into a room the first way, I can already feel my energy starting to manifest everybody around me, right? I'm all down and shit. As soon as they see that I'm down and they see I'm playing at a low vibration, they're all going to try to come down and match my energy, right? Same thing, guys, when I get on the live here, who who here feels that their vibration and that that their energy levels fucking immediately skyrocket when they get onto my live stream? Who in here feels that way? 
because I feel that way when I get on to my mentors and my coaches live streams and podcasts when I listen to them speak I'm like fired up let's go let's let's go my vibration skyrockets huge difference huge difference Stephen yes yes guys it is about how you carry it's about this vibration baby are you guys full of fire are you full of lightning Right? Are you full of sludge? Are you full of shit that's just dragging you down? Right? What are you filling your minds with every day? What are you filling your fucking mind and your soul with? You're filling it with toxic food and seed oils and Netflix and blue light before bed and EMFs through your AirPods and no sunlight and a vegan diet, no exercise? Or are you fueling it with sunlight, with fucking water, with red meat, with all the good stuff, with exercise, with resistance training, with a quality tribe around you, a good supportive group, a good supportive network, a family, right? Like who, what are you deciding to surround yourself with? Because all of that is going to have a huge impact with the vibration that resides within you, right? That's all going to affect the vibration that's within you. Guys, hit some hearts, hit some fire if I'm hitting this right now. Hits, I want to see some people in the in the comments. I want to see, I, I, I want to see that this is hitting someone in the chest today, guys. Vibration is everything. Vibration is, I want to see it in the comments, Steven. Vibration is everything. Let me see it in the comments. I don't care if you're on the replay. I don't care if you're if you're on the podcast. You, if you're on the podcast, I want you to screenshot your screen and I want you to tag me at Chance Galloway Fitness. And I want you to say vibration is everything. And I want you to post it on your story. Tag me so I see that you guys got some value from today's episode. Vibration is everything. Come on now, guys. Happy freaking Monday. I hope you guys are having the best day. Not just Monday, but the best day ever. Have the best fucking day of your whole life. Come on. That's some high vibrational shit. That's some high vibrational energy. When I tell you guys to have the best day ever, come on. Come on, that is not, we're not playing here, guys. We're playing past the ceiling. I'm like, we're playing high, man. Guys, I'm high on life. I don't take drugs. I don't drink. It sucks that I don't work out because that's my drug of choice. But guys, I'm high on life, man. I am high on this. I'm high on you guys. I'm high on my clients. I'm high on success. I'm high on getting my nose fixed in 20 days. And hopefully getting all of my issues fixed and feeling good and praising the Lord. And that's what I'm high on. What are you guys high on? I'm high on life. I play at a high vibration. I play, I play a high vibration every 24 hours. Even when I'm down, I try to pull myself up. And if I'm down and I can't get up, I look at my girlfriend. Or I, look, I look at people in my life, my family, my clients even, right? Like, Steven, bro, you've been there for me, man. Like I look at people around me to hold me up to say, Chance, get off your ass, show that high vibrational energy and be you, dude. Go out and be you. Yes, every day is the new best day of my life. Yes, Steven Sella, my man in the building. Yes, sir, spit the facts, bro, spit in the fire. Let's go. Tony, brother, you just missed a fire podcast episode. If you guys have some water, make sure you guys are drinking your water today. Like I said, feed the mind, feed the body, feed the spirit with positive, high vibrational foods and, and things, right? That's what it's about. So you can play on that higher level. You guys got to play on that higher level to expect a new and progressive result out of your life. If you guys want to take it to the next level, you guys can't be playing down here. You guys have to be playing through this. You guys got to be playing at a whole new level. A whole new vibrational level. Energy is everything in this game. You guys want to transform your bodies, right? You want to put on 15 pounds of muscle. You want to feel confident taking your shirt off at the beach. You want to feel good and, 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 and look good when you're naked, right? Who doesn't want that? Shit. That's part of the reason why I started working out in the first place. I was so insecure, but not only taking my shirt off because I was always a skinny kid, but I was like 16, right? And I... Still haven't lost my virginity yet, right? A little TMI, but that's just the truth of it. And I knew like pretty soon that that was going to happen for me. And I was like, I need to start where I want to feel good. Here. Like I want to feel good here, right? So that when I do take it to the bedroom and I do have, I start to have those experiences as a young man, I can feel good. I can feel confident. 
I mean, who doesn't want that? Who doesn't want to feel good when they're having sex? Who doesn't want to feel good when they're at the beach and they take their shirt off? Like, it's impressive, guys, when, when you're with family or friends and you're the outcast. You're the one with the six pack, right? You're the one that has shredded abs. You're the one that has the bicep vein, right? You're the one that has a big bulky chest and you feel good and you feel strong, right? The traps, you got the veins coming down in your lats, right? You got the thick quads. Who doesn't want that? Who doesn't want to feel confident and good in their own skin? The reason why I love it so much, guys, is because I was once that skinny kid. I hated taking my shirt off. I hated being naked. I didn't like it because I didn't feel good in my own skin. And I know there's so many of you out there that might feel the same exact way. But guys, have the best day ever. That's all I got for you today. I got to go. I got a super busy day. I got a super busy week before the keys. I'm going to be doing my client check-ins next Friday, not this Friday, from the Florida Keys. So that's going to be really cool. Um, so that's it. That's all. I will open it up for questions for a couple minutes after I end this podcast. If you guys are still listening, thank you so much for listening all the way through. If you are listening on the podcast and you guys want to help me spread this message to more people, the way that we do that is through our ratings and reviews. So if you guys go scroll all the way down on our, on our show, the relentless life with chance gallery, scroll all the way down, click ratings and reviews. You can click reviews and you can leave us a review. However you felt about today's message. If you gained some value, speak about maybe what you learned, how vibration is everything. And that will help me uh, with the algorithm on the Apple podcast app. Get this message to more people, as many people as possible. We're trying to affect billions, baby. I'm not doing this for the small time. I'm not doing this at a low vibrational level, guys. I'm doing this to affect billions of people, millions, billions. I don't care, guys. I want to affect the entire world with my message. I want to change as many lives as possible with this mentality, with the relentless life, with, with making the decision that I'm going to get up every day and I'm going to be great. I'm going to go out. I'm going to serve the world. I'm going to feel good. I'm going to look good. I'm going to shake my anxiety and I'm going to be a a good human being to my community. That's what it's, it's about. It's about doing that. It's about serving. It's about feeling good guys. Cause life is so short. We don't know all of our lives are going to expire one day. We don't know when our last day is. So let's give it our all. Let's be freaking relentless. And I will see you guys tomorrow at 12 p.m. for Tuesday's podcast episode. And uh, stay tuned for that one, guys. Super excited for that. 12 p.m. tomorrow. Much love, much respect. Stay freaking relentless. We'll talk to you guys soon. Peace. And the recording stopped. Let's freaking go, guys. Good podcast. If you guys have any questions, you guys can leave them in the comments, whether you guys are on Facebook, if you're on Instagram. Um or if you guys are just on the replay, throw the comments out there. I would be happy to address those now. I'm only going to stay here for a few minutes. I do have to go. I have to drop my girlfriend's car off at the Honda dealership for an oil change, tire rotation, stuff like that before the keys this weekend. So busy, 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 busy. And I just had my dad ask me if I can go check on a, on a roofing job of a buddy of mine down here in Fort Myers. So Lots of stuff going on, on top of all the stuff we have with online coaching. So hopefully you guys are having a great day. Hopefully you enjoyed today's message. Hopefully everybody is freaking crushing their day. The tone is being set today, guys. Remember, the tone is being set today. Today sets the tone for Tuesday, for Wednesday, for because it's a new week, right? Today starts the beginning of a new week. So I like... Getting up on a Monday, saying my affirmations. If I'm alone, preferably in my house with no neighbors, I fucking scream my affirmations. I'll be honest, I do. And I feel freaking amazing. I feel amazing when I do that. And I encourage you guys to do that as well, as long as you don't live with old people or kids or wives, girlfriends that are going to yell at you for doing that. It's happened to me a few times. That's why I say that. But that's it, guys. If you guys don't have any comments or questions or anything like that, Um, Definitely share this with anyone that might need to hear this message today that might need to uh, be woken up to to playing at a new vibration, to playing at a higher vibration. Uh, Because guys, like at the end of the day, the the reason why I get on to these lives every single day, Monday through Friday and do this, um, it's not because I get anything out of it. It's because I want to wake people up. I want to wake people up to the fact that, like I said a few minutes ago, life is so freaking short. And if we don't wake up now, I don't know if you guys are ever going to fucking wake up.
Like you guys have to start to play at a different level. You're, if you play at the same level you've always played at, you're always going to get what you've always gotten. You can relate that to happiness. Like if you always play at a low vibration, you're always going to be just as happy as you've been. If you guys want to be happier, if you want to be healthier, if you want to live a longer, higher quality, more fulfilling life, you guys are going to have to up your vibration a little bit. You're going to have to up that energy and you're going to have to feed your mind, your body, and your spirit with things that are going to allow you to play at that level. Meditation, a lot of water, good animal-based foods, enriching exercise, getting out in sunlight every day for 30 to 60 minutes, journaling your thoughts, taking care of your mental health. Like all of these things, guys, are going to allow you to play at that high vibrational level. That's what's gotten me to where I'm at. You know, I lost a lot of weight and it's because of reasons that I'm still trying to figure out, but I will get to the bottom of it. But for you guys, you need to start doing these habits. You need to start implementing an animal-based diet. You need to start getting outside, getting more sunlight. You need to start doing functional exercises and functional movements. Yes, the gym is great. Yes, resistance training is great, but don't, pl don't, you know, play in one in one range of motion. Get out and just do active things. Play some basketball. Um, you know, skate around. Like, do some stuff. Swim. Go for a swim. Go for a bike ride. Do things that are multiplanar that are going to keep you in a functional biomechanical position. So that's it, guys. That's all. It seems no one has any questions. I'm going to end these live streams. Much love, much respect. Peace out, guys. Have the best freaking day of your entire life, and I will see you guys tomorrow, 12 p.m. Peace.